Hey, I'm Michael, and this is COVID-19 Explained for Nova Scotians. First, a little about me. I'm a fourth year medical student at Dalhousie University, which means I'm almost a doctor. You know, the pandemic has all of us, my friends and mom included, asking a lot of questions. So we thought we'd help clarify any confusion that Nova Scotians might be having when it comes to COVID-19. Let's get to it. So what does asymptomatic mean? The short answer is that asymptomatic means that you don't feel sick or you don't have symptoms. This might mean you're not infected, but you could actually be infected with the virus. People who are asymptomatic and are infected can still spread it to other people. Here's the thing, most people infected with the virus that causes COVID-19 show symptoms within five to six days, but the time between infection and onset of symptoms can range anywhere from one to 14 days and some people actually never develop symptoms. We're learning that up to 50% of people who are infected don't have symptoms and can spread it to other people, which is why it's so important, even when you're asymptomatic, to get tested. So what is rapid testing? Right now in Nova Scotia, there are several streams to get tested for COVID-19, and one of them is pop-up rapid testing. Rapid testing is a bit different from the PCR testing we started with. Instead of looking for the virus's genetic material, the rapid test looks for protein or an antigen. The test is really easy. It's just a swab to the back of the nose. And the coolest part is that it only takes 15 minutes to get a result. The accuracy is different from the tests we started with, but we're using it in a different way. We're testing low risk people who really wouldn't have otherwise been tested. So who can get rapid testing? In Nova Scotia, we're offering rapid testing to people that don't have some other reason to make them higher risk for having been infected with COVID-19. So if you haven't traveled, you don't have symptoms, you haven't visited a potential exposure location and haven't been in contact with someone who has tested positive, and you're over the age of 16, you can get rapid testing. This pop-up rapid testing is a really great way for us to understand how much COVID-19 infection is in the population. And it really helps us catch asymptomatic cases that we could have missed. We're offering rapid pop-up testing all around the province and we're announcing the sites on our social media accounts. So be sure to follow here. Getting tested is a really great way to help us fight COVID-19 in Nova Scotia. So how can I get a COVID-19 test? Well, that depends. If you have symptoms, you should use the COVID-19 self-assessment tool on the website. If you've been at a site listed with an exposure notice where testing is recommended, you should immediately self-isolate and also check out the COVID-19 self-assessment tool. If you're wanting to get asymptomatic testing, we're announcing pop-up sites on social media. The important thing to remember though is that any infection has a period of time where you could still be infected and not test positive. So a negative test is really only valid for the day you get it. We're reminding people that a negative test doesn't rule out infection. So in order to protect yourselves and others, you need to keep wearing your masks, wash your hands, maintain six feet of physical distance, and keep your social circle as small as you can. And that's COVID-19 Explained for this week. Check back soon to learn more. And until then, Nova Scotia, keep looking out for each other and do your part to get tested.